Sa ating entertainment news, apat na putlimang kandidata ng Miss World Philippines opisyal nang iniharap sa media. Narito ang report. Formal nang ipinakilala sa entertainment press ang 2021 batch ng Miss World Philippines. Sa press launch kahapon, July 15, ipinakilala ang apat na putlimang naggagandahang mga kababaihan mula sa iba't ibang panig ng bansa na siyang maglalaban-laban ng iba't ibang titulo ng Miss World Philippines Organization. Suot ang kanika nilang casual wears at maging ng kanilang swimwear. Rumamba ang mga aspiring candidates na maglalaban-laban para sa walong titulo at corona na nasa ilalim ng Miss World Philippines Organization. Tulad ng Miss Philippines Tourism, Miss Multinational, Reina Hispano-Americana, Miss Eco Teen Philippines, Miss Eco Philippines, Miss Supranational, Miss Environment International, at ang prestigyos ng Miss World Philippines. Isa naman sa apat na putlimang nagagandahang mga dilag na ipinakilala ay ang EBC Net 25 News Provincial Correspondent na si Celine Kyle Dorado mula sa Pampanga bilang candidate number 20. I'm Kyle Celine Dorado, 19 years old, Net 25 News Correspondent and Broadcaster representing Mabalacan City, Pampanga. <laughs> Before I got into the lock-in, because we had our lock-in, I actually did a last-minute um, like reporting for EBC po. But then right now, yes, I'm focusing on Miss World, but whatever that I can help with my um, provincial team po from EBC, I am doing it po. I am someone who really wants to fulfill my purpose and I want to be able to use this privileges of being a public figure to actually make this as a platform for my advocacy, which is mental health. That is something very dear to me that I have experienced. I had mental health issues in the past. I really want to share my story because I owe other people my story because by sharing my own story, I give them the permission to admit the same that they're also struggling with their life. Kahit ngayon dumaranas ng pandemya ang bansa, tuloy pa rin ang kanilang pangarap at mga advokasiyang kanilang nais na ipagpatuloy. Ito ang dedikasyon ng ilang mga kandidata ng Miss World Philippines. What really motivated me to join Miss World Philippines is really the advocacy part of this pageant. It's really much more than just physical beauty and brains. It demands a purpose. It's actually known for beauty with a purpose. And me as an environmental law professor and a sustainability lawyer, I want to use this platform in order to reach out to more of the youth and all all different kinds of generations to understand and value our environment and sustainability. Beauty with a purpose and beauty in giving because I believe that um, beauty in giving, when we give, it's always a privilege. So that's why I joined this pageant. If ever I win, I will continue to support the organization and um, educate, try to educate and make people aware of how important to our health is. Maka inspire na other um, uh, young women din ang gusto maging katulad ng sa amin and then the advocacy na, na share namin sa iba. Suportado din ng lahat ng kandidata ang vaccination rollout na isinasagawa ng pamahalaan at naniniwala sila na ito ang tanging paraan upang mas lalo nating malabanan ang coronavirus pandemic. Luckily, everyone in the Miss World organization, they thankfully allowed us to get vaccine vaccines. Like I was fortunate just to have received my first dose recently and with that, it makes me a little less nervous, but I still have to take the precautions necessary for when I go international, if ever I go international. And the people that I'm around make sure I'm following protocols. I'm actually a health professional. I am a dentist and so I really believe in vaccines. Um, it has been proven before in different um, diseases before. We have fought against polio and other diseases. This, please, let's, let's let the vaccines work for COVID this time. So let's get vaccinated. I am kay National Director Arnold Vegafia. Pangunahing ipinatutupad umano nila sa pageant na ito ay ang napagkasunduan nila ng IATF na pagsunod sa lahat ng ipinatutupad na health protocols ng gobyerno. Kaya kahit nabawasan man sila ng outdoor activities para sa mga kandidata at karamihan dito ay online o virtual activities na lamang. Kung ito ang paraan upang mapanatili ang health safety ng buong produksyon, ay ito ang kanilang patuloy na sinusunod at ipinatutupad. We don't have provincial destination because of the 
IATF rule, and it's so hard to stage to do to do provincial because they have to be quarantined and they have to be, you know, put in a bubble. So it's hard for us. Despite of the pandemic, we'll do our best to, you know, to entertain our the Filipinos and. And thank you to all the supporters and also the government of keep on of helping us and supporting us with with our organization. So July 25 naman gaganapin na ang coronation night ng naturang national beauty pageant. Uling Filipina na nakakuha ng Miss World title ay si Megan Young of 2013. Walang naganap na Miss World coronation Philippines nang nakarang taon dahil sa pandemya. Samantala si Michelle Daniela din naman ang may hawak ng titulo ng Miss World Philippines noong 2019 na siya ning maglilipat at magpapatong ng corona sa bagong hihiranging Miss World Philippines 2021. Para sa Eagle News, Emma Tiglao, we live in interesting times. Samantala, tagi sa